Hi friends, my name is Brother Chris Woods. I am currently stationed at San Lorenzo Friary in Jamaica Plain in Boston, but I'm currently with you from the Holy Mountain of Graymore in New York. A whole group of us were just up here for a few days of all different Franciscan branches of the uh, people in formation. We all get together for a few days to not only to share in the richness of our Franciscan tradition, but also to build fraternity with each other um, across different branches of the order, across different traditions, and it was such a beautiful opportunity. But anyways, the reason I'm here with you today is to talk about Lent. I honestly can't believe we're already in the third week of Lent. It is flying by, and I always want to take full advantage of Lent. Um, I hate when it goes too quickly, because I feel like I want to cram so much in it and really make it a fruitful time where I am drawing closer to our Lord. Uh, but I think the best thing we could do is take a moment right now to refocus and to uh, put our heart and our mind where it should be to draw closer to our Lord. In today's readings, we have a reading from Deuteronomy and from the Gospel of Matthew, both talking about Jesus deepening our laws, deepening our, uh, our understanding of the laws. Um, you know, Jesus did come to shake things up, but he came not to abolish all the laws, but to really help us to, I think, understand them a little bit more and to show us maybe the merits of some of them. So, so many people I know look at Lent, especially those outside the church, look at Lent as, oh, you have all these rules, all these requirements, so why do I want to bother with that? That's, that's not what God is about. But these rules, these guidelines, you know, uh, not eating meat on Fridays or um, maybe doing fasting on Wednesdays and Fridays, a lot of people do that tradition, or giving something up. These are all meant to help us to draw away from the world and to draw closer to our Lord. So let's take the words from Jesus today, that he's here to not to abolish the law, but to help us to enter more fully into it. Let's enter more fully into it and into the season of Lent and draw closer to our Lord and to his most sacred heart as we journey toward his glorious resurrection at Easter. May God bless you.